fun, laughter, playing, studying. We loved being together, the five of us. We had a gala of time when we were with each other, on the way to school, during class hours, and after school. We were inseparable. That's what we thought. And then that moment happened. Varun was hospitalized and he was critical. Doctor said Varun was suffering from a severe case of diarrhea and he was not the only one. The doctor said it could be because of all the garbage that is in his neighborhood. We wanted to bring a change. Varun and many others were not out of danger. We searched the internet, spoke to teachers. We realized that there was no proper disposal of garbage in the locality. Every house dumped waste without segregating. Not only that, they were throwing away waste items that could be reused and recycled. It had started polluting the land, the water, the air, and was affecting all lives in the locality. We had to bring a change. Waste had to be segregated, and we thought of a simple way to do it. Sticker in six different colors, yellow for dry waste, such as paper, clothes and shoes, blue for wet waste, like food, fruits and vegetables, meats and leaves, red for sanitary waste, such as diapers, medicines and needles, orange for all plastic items, such as bags, milk covers and bottles, green for all recyclable items made of glass, wood or metal, and grey for all electronic components, bulbs, chargers and batteries. We spoke to our teachers and with the help of other students, we decided to launch a drive to clean the locality. We printed the stickers and gave it to every house. We kept bins with the same stickers at the end of every street. We had street plays in different places in the locality where we showed people what waste should go in which bin. The people in the locality started putting the waste in the right bins. The locality started looking cleaner. Similar cleanliness drives took place in other localities. And Varun was also a part of it. The five of us were together again. And we were inseparable.